After 10 years of singing on the operatic stage, I love breaking down lyrics, and I love listening to music in a more detailed way. Today we're going to be listening to Iris 17514, I'm really excited, as well as watching Thus Spoke Apocalypse, the animated short that connects to regression as well. So I'm really excited to dive into more depression, uh, Honkai Impact, and let's do it. Right, as I've come to understand Otto, Otto is not a, uh, a, a character that is necessarily well-liked. Otto does things that are for his benefit because Otto um, loves someone and wants to save them, and it's very important to him that things happen the way that they should. And right off the bat, immediately, you hear that intensity in this music, the cybernetic alternate reality universe where everything is sort of happening and he's trying to push through in order to, to rescue his love, and they'll stop at nothing. And so we hear that forward momentum with those drums and it's it's really it's really intense and frankly it's probably one of the more intense tracks i've heard within honkai uh impact third and we we love that we love this sort of intensity we love when a character commits something that makes us dislike them because the stakes are high and it gives us a foil emotionally be like well you he did this he you know i can't believe he did that you know and 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 this character caused tremendous suffering in the world of Honkai Impact 3rd. Yeah, it's really interesting. Let's keep listening. I love the intensity of, of, of this singing is very interesting to me because it's actually pretty much in spoken range. But then it's interesting because as the singer goes up, it, it, it's that shouting quality. It's a shouted, in some ways, a primal scream. And actually, opera singing is essentially a beautiful screaming. And so when, when we don't have that operatic quality to this, but we have like a pop sound, oftentimes when we go up into the upper range, there is this feeling because, oh boy, we're about to get technical. Because when we go up and singing, there's a moment where we have to flip into what's called head voice, right? We go up into head voice. Oftentimes in pop singing, there's not a lot of head voice used. And there's a lot of throat voice or a lot of chest voice. And when we bring up, that can be extremely effective in music, especially in music like this, where there's a visceral pain that's occurring in this sound quality and this intensity. It, it would be too beautiful. Not that this isn't beautiful because it is, but it would be too beautiful to flip into head voice. And, and pop singers do this. All sorts of singers sing in head voice. It's a normal process of singing. But there is a brutality in this music. There's a, be a beautiful brutality in this music, but there is a brutality nonetheless. And so enabling the voice to go up into that upper register and, and, and point it from the throat and from the chest makes this so much more impactful than if it was like, na, na, ha, na, 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 na. like that's too pretty if I do say so much, you know what I mean? Like it's too pretty. And so having that quality in the sound is fantastic. And it burns my heart so I can share open If there's a way to go I can portray A modern color be projected into If there is a way to 
Short and sweet. Short and sweet. Now look at the lyrics. The stars are distant as always, still shining with the light of their grand deaths in vacant space. Let it penetrate darkness when a beast roars a final wail. Let it penetrate my heart so I can share your pain. If there is a way to collect and portray a mood that cannot be projected into words, if there is a way to turn back and rebuild all the long lost dreams, another branch will grow and flourish in the future. The breeze of your world will wake you up again. The suffering here of Otto, the desire to move back time, to go back, to, to, to break through the barriers of life blocking him. This desire to turn back and rebuild all the long lost dreams. That is the crux of this character. That is the motivation. We always have to find a motivation when we're talking about characterization. That is the motivation. If there's a way to collect and portray a mood that cannot be projected into words, if there is a way to turn back and rebuild all the long lost dreams, well, damn it, that's what I'm gonna do. Because I love you and I need you back and I'll do whatever it takes. Even if I have to destroy this entire freaking world to do it, that's what I'm gonna do. And Apparently, that's what happens. Let's watch the short. Honkita. しかし手にしたのは冷たい手かせと工場だった。世界は混沌としている。それは不公平で。不合理だ。悪は力を増す。醜いものばかりだ。美しいものなどない。世界の悪意は悪人が断ち切ろう。This music is really setting the mood so beautifully. This music is haunting. This music is sad. A somber, simple piano is is causing us to understand the sadness of, of, of this whole experience for both of these characters. There is so much at stake here and, and there is a feeling of like, I can't do anything. And so Otto is taking his life into his own hands and in his on his own terms. There does seem to be a bit of nihilism in Otto, this, this sense that you know, if nihilism is the def the definition of nihilism is the belief that all values are baseless and that nothing can be known or communicated, there is this feeling of this exasperation with life and the frustration and and anger and you know pointing that outward towards towards the universe and towards the world. You know, fine, I'll become the villain. Whatever. You know, there's a, there's a blasé attitude about this that's very interesting. <laughs> <laughs> これは彼女と明日までの距離。そして彼女も死んじゃは決して諦めない。<笑> 
This music is visceral. This music is, this music is so powerful. And this music showcases the unbridled strength and capacity for destruction and, and sticking to his ideals that, you know, it, it's really aiding in telling the story. <laughs> Is that a giant crucifix? Do you hear the beginnings of regression here? This is a really interesting build up into it. <laughs> Too much of the past. 
Clock. Along the path of time, every night brings a dream, but the day that lives late keeps me away. All the rest will be torn up with never a choice. so beautiful they have such a bond transcending time and space man yeah it really showcases you know the capacity for love to defy time space death itself it's fascinatingly beautiful it's really really gorgeous it's really interesting to listen to. As always, if you like this sort of stuff, there's a lot more Honkai Impact to come on the channel. Feel free to like and subscribe. And, and hey, there are links in the About section if you want to support the channel too, but there's never any pressure. Huh. As always, thanks a ton, and I'll talk to you later. Bye.